guys. Tonight we are here at the Graceland Complex getting ready to go see the 2021 version of Elvis in Concert. Now what this is, is they put Elvis on a video screen. They take out all the band noise from years ago, all the original recordings, and they have a live band play. So it's pretty cool, huh, Bobby? Bobby's seen it yeah, before. Yeah, I saw it before. It's really good. And uh, they're going to bring in uh, a few of his old band members, but uh, Elvis's voice just is incredible in here. And James it's a, Burton. James Burton, Glenn Harden, Larry Strickland, and Terry Blackwood of the Imperials. So it's going to be a great show. We hope you like it. I mean, a lot of it's just going to be footage you've seen before, but you almost got to be here to totally experience it. We're going to film it, and uh, if you want to watch it, go ahead and watch it, because I think it's worth it. So are you ready, Bobby? I'm ready. Let's rock and roll. Let's rock and roll. Special person, special to all of us, and especially special to Elvis Presley. Please make welcome Priscilla Presley. <laughs> Soft lights were coming on, and he looked, and of course the show began. 
and he gave one hell of a show. Oh, and it was so unbelievable that Sammy Davis Jr. came into the dressing room, I was there, and he said, oh my God, Elvis, I've never ever seen a performance like this. There is no other entertainer that could put an act on like you. He was like almost on his knees praising Elvis. The same with Cary Grant, he also came. Frank Sinatra were there. Elvis couldn't believe it. He was like, I mean, after that, it was like, the rest is history. You all saw the show, and that was the show. And yes, he got nervous just like everybody else, but what a show it was, and we have all been able to see it on the 68th, not the 68th special as well, but to see him perform, but that stage show was, Phenomenal, and no one to this day can match it. No. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, um, it is so wonderful to have you here and to hear you tell these stories about Elvis because you were there and you saw it firsthand. And we always get to hear the human side of Elvis Presley, who we all have put up here on the pedestal, where he belongs, of course, but we forget sometimes that he was a man, and you see, you tell us the human side of it, that we get to hear and reminds us that he was a real guy. And um, it's just such a thrill to get to hear this stuff from you. Ladies and gentlemen, Priscilla Presley. Career. Please make welcome Mr. Terry Blackwood and Mr. Mark
So we're obviously, of course, Elvis Presley would be nervous about doing a performance like this that was going to be seen by this many people around the planet. What about you guys in the band? Were you nervous as well? Well, we uh, obviously this meant a lot to Elvis Presley. You were there when uh, this was done at Blaisdell Arena, but you guys didn't just do one show. You did a show the night before, didn't you? Uh, I can't quite remember. We went over a little early and rehearsed the whole thing. Seems like we went in October or November or something, uh, and pulled it together and then uh, went to the real thing in January. Well, it's, uh, it's, we're going to let you relive some of that here tonight. Uh, obviously, it meant a lot to Elvis Presley, not just um, uh, that performance, which was very, very exciting for Elvis to do something unprecedented like that. Nobody had really done a satellite broadcast, not, not a single artist had done a satellite broadcast around the world like that to that many people at one time. So obviously, Elvis was very excited about uh, not only that performance, but performing live in general, did he seem like he was, every time he came on stage every night, did he seem excited about hitting the stage? Yes, he did. He paced back and forth like a racehorse. You know? yeah. <laughs> and he couldn't wait to get out there and get it going. Well, let's, uh, let's listen to Elvis Presley in his own words talk about not only how excited he was about live performance, but about doing this unprecedented satellite uh, uh, broadcast. Jen, uh, Glenn, you'll take your place on the piano right here, and let's listen to Elvis in his own words. It's uh, very hard to comprehend because I, in 15 years, it's hard to comprehend that happened. You know, all the countries all over the world by satellite. It's very difficult to comprehend. A live concert, to me, is exciting because of all the electricity that's was generated in the crowd and on stage. But uh, it's my favorite part of the business. This is a live, live concert.
you've heard him on an incredible number of records. He's played on so many that he's forgotten how many he's played on, trust me. But you hear him every day sometimes, and you know it as soon as you listen to the radio and you hear that sound, and you know it's undeniably the one and only great Mr. James Burton. <laughs> Thank you. 